And we're back. Hello. This is getting. This we're is getting, getting really cute, I guess. Oh, we're almost at the end. Once I agreed, we began to we began the process of switching me in as a poster girl. With Grunosuke's help, I somehow navigated the unknown world and finished my photo shoot. Dude, that would be really embarrassing. Mm -hmm. It was just a few days ago that the poster was released, wasn't it? Yeah, they're already up in the store. Your opinion is also of high value now, too. R really? You've got great insights, and you really could. <coughs> you really could. <coughs> you really consider the best way to show off our products. It's only because I general I genuinely love Tornia, and I want everyone else to love them too. You've got a good future ahead of you. Well, why don't we hit our deer? I'll buy you a drink. Great, thank you. The chimes jingled loudly as we both walked inside the bar. Hey, Yuzi and Butt! <laughs> good to see you. Oh my God, <laughs> it's been a while, hasn't it? You look well, both of you. Because Torania is so busy, the store is still always packed. Yeah, fortunately we're doing great. It's pulling even more burden on butt though. I don't mind. I'm having a great time helping. Speaking of which, I believe your store posters changed recently. Yeah, that's right. We were just talking about them. What the fuck, you stalkers? I know, right? Oh my god, those posters are talking about mine. Oh my god. Oh, I saw them too! The new poster girl is pretty good, isn't she, Yuzi? Oh my god. Fuck you. That's all right. She's got a great body, obviously, but also... Ah, uh, you know what I mean. No, we don't know. You're... you're... No, we don't know. You're getting senile. Leave me alone. I am old anyway, aren't I? What the fuck? Don't get all introspective now. Oh, all right. Anyway, I kind of know what he's... I kind of know what he's you're talking about. Oh. <laughs> I've seen them too. <laughs> Her tatas. There's a sense that she really wants you wants to show off the clothing. A kind of innocence, right? Why are you looking at me like that, Mama Ru? <laughs> <laughs> Mama Ru and Yorahisa and both sharp are both sharp. Maybe they know it's me. What the fuck? It's obvious. Well, unless they put her like in a wig or something, I don't know. Oh, maybe. That's the naivety that was just too adorable to turn down. Finally, from Ryanosuke himself. I think you're all right now. I owe you. I owe that and everybody else to the women I to the woman I love, the one who changed my life. Aww. I'm not a virgin anymore. I know, right? You really have changed. You, if you hadn't, you'd never have even said that out loud just now. Anyway, it was good of you to accept too, but... I guess it was obvious after all, huh? It was all Ryu's doing. Obviously. Oh my god. Wait, 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 I'm lost here. Let's see. Oh my god, you're too cute. You're fucking... I, I wanna do him next. <laughs> so this season's poster girl, it's... The model on the poster? It's me. Stupid. When I pushed away my shyness and said so, Hideki was the only one who looked surprised. What? <laughs> I faffed that! Yeah, alright. It's hard to believe someone as in love with butt as you wouldn't notice. Shit! Oh, shit! <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, his, he's not important. Yeah. Well, everyone else apparently knew except for you. Oh! <laughs> I suppose that means you're the least perspective, you're the least perspective of the group, when, and you're the detective. <laughs> what the fuck? Are you? Sh are we sure he's the detective? Yeah, Maybe he's, he's just a regular cop. I think he's a cop detective. I don't know. Oh no! Shut up. <laughs> Apparently, she's gotten favorable reception from customers too. Consumers. Cons okay. Not that I'm surprised. Were you? You'll only make things worse by getting embarrassed now. Damn, you got you got balls, Sunling. Uh, right. I know, I know, but Although I don't feel good when I think about all those guys here staring at your posters. What the fuck? You should have thought about that beforehand. Uh, Alright. Then why did you ask me to do it in the first place? To remind myself that you don't belong only to me. That's not true. 
Aw, uh, don't worry. I'd never try and go after you at this point. What? Asshole? She's been touched on a one. Alright, sloppy seconds. <laughs> it's true. I don't think any of us would. Hehe. <laughs> And I'd appreciate it if you all kept it that way. Yeah, don't touch her. You're mine. You just said she's not all your, t all yours. But now you're saying she is. What are you trying to say here? You're confusing yeah. me. It, this is so embarrassing. What's going on today? <laughs> the conversation at the bar stayed lively until we left to walk home arm in arm. In arm. arm and hammer. Mm-hmm. I was looking down to hide the blush remaining on my face when I heard a voice from above my head. Are you feeling disillusioned a little bit about me? Huh? What the fuck are you talking about? At my jealousy. I know the guys aren't always like that, but still. I guess I learned yet another thing about you. But I didn't sense, like, jealousy at all. Yeah. You're mistaken if you think that'd be enough to get rid of me, though. Good, because that just makes me want to keep you even more. Yay. Not that I'd ever want to leave you either. We naturally exchanged a smile and tightened the grip of our entwined hands. Whoa. <laughs> what? You didn't know? Know about what? You can't just ask me if I've heard and expect me to know about... Know what about... What? You really don't know then. I was sure Yuzi would have told you. Oh, so it has nothing to do with Torinia? Bullseye! I've brought your drinks. First, an Irish black lager for Mr. Kodama. And for Miss Plug, a Bellini. Thank you, Zorichiro. And how Oh, he's Toy Toyo Izumi. Yeah. Wait. What the fuck? And, and how is Mr. Yuse lately, Miss Plug? I haven't seen him for nearly two weeks. I guess he's really busy. Which was why I ordered a drink that reminded me of him, weird as it seemed. Which is what? Yeah, that, that's it. That definitely has something to do with what I was talking about. What the fuck are you getting all excited about? It was true that Ryunosuke had been busy lately. Several times he hadn't even picked up my calls. Even oh. the emails he wrote me an apology came late into the night. So just what was it exactly? An affair. Well, it's about Toronia. Sometime about noon. I was sort of wandering around, you know? There was a huge crowd around Tornia, so I thought I'd check out what was going on. The employees were all running around trying to deal with the people shouting. They were like, Is it true a new brand's gonna be coming out? When is it being released? A new brand? No way! I feel like I'd heard Ryo mention something about that before, but I guess it's really happening. That reminds me, when I passed by Tornia, there was quite an uproar then as well. Is the release of the new brand such an important event? It's a huge event! Is it? I guess. It was a seasonal event wherein a unique new Tornia brand would be launched. Especially because women love sales and limited editions. I see. Of course, there are also a lot of people that just want new new brand name goods. The launch com commemora com commemoration sales and promotions are <laughs> famous and really popular. It's called the Torinia Festival. Ah, marketing's a tough business. Though Hideki looks satisfied, I took an unconvinced sip of my drink. Why would Ryu not tell me about the new brand? It's got your name. I'll ask him next time we talk. I don't the like fuck feeling fuck his dis- Oh my god, that is so fucking hilarious. <laughs> and we end this episode. Ah. Oh. Isn't there like eight chapters, so this next one's gotta be the final one. Yeah, I think we're almost done. Okay. Alright. We'll see you all later. Yes. Bye. Bye.